ABC is an equilateral triangle. AD, BE and CF are respectively perpendicular to AB, BC and CA such that DBE, ECF and FAD are straight line segments. Then find area of triangle DEF divided by area of triangle ABC. Let's get started. First of all, you could very easily find that triangle DEF is also equilateral. Moreover, by symmetry, you could also find that the three right angle triangles ACF, BAD and CBE are all congruent. So, let's name the sides as B and C. After naming all these sides, our diagram looks something like this. Now, if we apply Pythagoras theorem in the right triangle, we have A square plus C square equals B square. Now from the question, the value that we have to find is area of triangle DEF divided by area of triangle ABC. Since both of these triangles are equilateral, this ratio would be same as the ratio of the squares of the sides. That is B plus the whole square by A square. From the Pythagoras theorem that we wrote, we could write A square as B plus C into B minus C. Now substituting it here, our answer reduces to B plus C by B minus C. Now our job is to find B by C plus 1 by B by C minus 1. So basically we are interested in the ratio of the lengths of the sides in the right triangle having angles as 90, 60 and 30. In order to find it, let's draw a CVN from the 90 degree vertex such that the upper angle equals 30 degree and the lower angle equals 60 degree. In the upper half, we get a isosceles triangle, whereas in the lower half, we get a equilateral triangle. From this, we could easily deduce that the CVN that we drew was the median of this triangle. Moreover, since the bottom triangle is equilateral, we have BE equals B by 2, that is B by 2 equals C. Now, Substituting B by C equals 2 in the previous ratio, we have 2 plus 1 by 2 minus 1 equals 3 as our answer. Thank you.